Hey everyone, it's Jeremy here from Ice Dogs. Just wanted to say a quick thank you to everyone who supported us through the season. Really appreciate it and we, we can he really hear you out there and it really does mean everything to us. Um, and I hope to see you next season and we'll, we'll, we'll go out there and get some wins for you. Hey guys, just wanted to take a moment to one, thank everyone for the support that we've had throughout the year. It um, has made a huge difference to how we've performed and the effort that everyone has put in throughout the year. From everyone on this team, like it really does make that difference and it means a lot. We've had a tough season this year and it's taken, like we've all taken a beating, but in saying that we've all grown throughout this season as well. And it's been nice to grow as a player um, and along with the team and the young guys that we've brought through this season. This season was a different one for us. It was a lot of learning involved at the start, throughout really, just learning and making a lot of mistakes. And being the youngest starter in the league with the youngest team in the league has just been an interesting dynamic in general. With a lot of young guys, a lot of new guys, where everyone's learning to communicate with each other from scratch. Everyone's learning to play with each other. Pretty much a clean slate for everyone, really. This year has uh, been tough. It's been uh, exciting. After a 14-year hiatus of playing in the National League, I was asked to help out this year with uh, the team was struggling with some injuries and a number of players didn't come back. So I've had a great time. The team has been extremely uh, welcoming, right from management to the coaching staff to all the players. It's been an unreal atmosphere. Um, I thoroughly, whilst, <clears throat> whilst the season didn't go to plan like we'd hoped, there's a lot of people playing their hearts out, giving 110% every time they touch the ice. People are banged up, sore and hurting and we're trying to get through to the end of the season and start for next year. I think there's a lot of really good people in this team, a lot of great personalities. Um, I think there's great leadership. Um, I can't say enough uh, good about these captains, you know, Pataki, Todd, um, Vasquez. They're all, they're all great guys to be leading a team and they all have their heads uh, in the right direction. And I think, um, I think a lot of the, the young guys in this team respect them and it's, it's really good being able to contribute to that. Goalie is 90% mental, 10% physical. So just learning that mental side of the game, coming off of tough losses, being able to come back and be in the right headspace to give the team a chance to win every night. Um, some nights I haven't been able to do that, but that experience of understanding how it feels to be at that low and learning how to come back from that, I think was very beneficial. It's a great culture. There's a lot of young kids here and a lot of young people who are willing to give 100% every time. Liam got his first goal last night, very pretty goal, and uh, you know, he was beaming, right? From, from when that moment was scored to breakfast the next morning, he's still smiling, all right? And the rest of the team will hopefully feed off that. Like, it was so exciting. We got the puck straight away, presented the puck to him. Everyone was so happy for him. It didn't matter that, you know, it was now, I don't know, 9-1 or 10-1, whatever. It, for him as developing as a player was awesome. And it was awesome team morale. Oh, the, the energy is electric after those wins. You know, we, have, we go through some real big highs and lows. The, the, the losses really kind of bring people down. But when, when we do get those wins and when we really grind out um, for the wins that we get, we, I feel like we really deserve them and we really work hard for them. Um, and I think we, we, it carries with us through the week and we, we really like that feeling and we're always striving to, to get that feeling every single game. It's just, it's just been a, a learning curve this year with a lot of young guys and a lot of new, new players and um, I think it's something to, to look forward to next year. Everyone knows that we've had a really young team this year and we've developed a whole lot of young kids and we're hoping to bring that into next year and into the future of the sport and the future of the Ice Dogs. So the plan is there, <clears throat> the building blocks are, are there. 
we've just got to follow through next season and keep moving forward. So yeah, just really want to thank you all for hanging on and um, hanging with us there in the tough times um, because we're going to need it next year. It's going to be bigger and better. Thank you. We thank everybody for their support, right from sponsors to game day people to coaches, management, everyone behind the scenes, everyone doing social media, videographers, all of the above. Yeah, we, we appreciate everyone and thank everyone for their support. Thanks for the support this season, guys. It's been a tough one and you've stuck with us the whole way. Next year is going to be much better. We're going to be much better. We're going to be more experienced and it's just going to be a better year. So please stick with us and we'll see you all next year. Go the Ice Dogs.